The 1930s and 40s was the great age of the radio organist. Like the big band leaders of the day, each one introduced himself to his faithful public with his own melody, his signature tune. This is Sandy McPherson. And the daddy of them all, Reginald Fort. And this tune heralded the arrival of Harold Ramsey. Probably the most familiar of all. Reginald Dixon playing the organ of the Playhouse Theatre Manchester, the very same instrument he made famous for some years in Blackpool. I remember as a boy, I, um, when I used to go to Blackpool, often used to walk out to see when the tide had gone out, and there was a roundabout that played a lot of these old melodies. One was, I remember, was yip i had ia ia and the other one was I do like to be beside the seaside. By the way, I must tell you, Robin, a long time ago, they had a, a zoo in the, in the tower, and uh, animals were in cages, various cages. Of course, I was billed on the front of the building, Mr. R. H. Dixon in those days, before the name Reginald was adopted, and it was R. H., Mr. R. H. Dixon at the uh, Wonder Wurlitzer. So a fellow came up one morning to the attendant on the front door. He says, hey, hey, come here. He says, uh, that wonder world it, sir. He says, which cage is it in? <laughs> so, I always used to join up with the band with this tune. I think everybody knows it. We call it fascination, anyhow. <laughs> Just once in a while, you find a real big old-time cinema, and with it, a fully working organ. Like the Gaumont State in Kilburn High Road, London. In the old days, our great moment came between the supporting programme and the feature, with that musical form so dear to the heart of every organist, the medley. So up we come with one to celebrate a bygone age, and perhaps to bring it back to life again just for a moment. Mm -hmm. 